I bought this August and Farms food storage emergency all in one 30 day supply. <clears throat> but I ate the macaroni and cheese and banana chips because they were so darn good. So now it's not a 30 day supply, I guess. 1822 calories. But man, the macaroni and cheese, the cheese on it is really, really good. And, and the banana chips, I just couldn't pass up. I don't know why. I can always get banana chips. And uh, I think I can look on Amazon. This is, I bought this on Amazon 10 years ago. And I've had it and I, I've yet to run out of foods all the way. So, um, I don't know, man. Was it worth it? $80 when I bought it for 30 days worth of food is why I bought it. Because I thought, well, gee, $80, you know, that's, that's pretty cheap. But, um... It's not very expensive to buy GNC protein powder. And, um, or a uh, weight gainer actually is better because you get all the calories. And, um, it doesn't cost a whole lot. And if you buy one of these, and some weight gainer or uh, some Campbell's soup. You're good to go. But I don't know. You know, some people are like storing up for a whole year and then they're going to go their whole life and all that food is going to go to waste. So this only has, I, I wouldn't trust 20 years. I opened the lid on it. I don't know. I mean, they're still in packages. Just a, a bunch of little packages. Creamy chicken and rice. And you got hearty vegetables. Creamy potato soup. Uh, just a bunch of different stuff in there. Brown sugar and oatmeal. And powdered milk. And Let's see what's all in there. You got morning mousse low fat milk. Banana chips, potato soup, hearty vegetable chicken, cheesy broccoli rice, instant potatoes, maple brown sugar, elbow macaroni, cheese powder, and creamy chicken and rice. It's got a nutrition thing on it. Augustin Farms. It did come with a water filtration bottle up to a hundred gallons. But I I uh don't I don't even remember it getting it. It's been ten years. shelf life product for up to 20 years when unopened so i don't know if that means the top of the lid or the pouches best when stored in a cool dry and dark place at temperatures between 55 and 70 degrees actual shelf life may vary based on individual storage condition i had it in a storage unit but it gets hot sometimes in the summer I don't know. I think there's been... I went to an RV show. And, man, they had some really, really good tasting. A lot... Um, Freeze-dried freeze stuff. Or uh, dehydrated foods. For... at the RV show for camping. And I don't think this comes near as good. Um, but the, the, I do like... The macaroni and cheese. I haven't tried any of the other stuff. I should... I, I just thought, well, I won't, you know, me, <laughs> better save it. But, um, 
probably the macaroni and cheese was good so maybe the rest of it the cheesy broccoli is going to be good the creamy potato soup and potatoes and brown sugar oatmeal cream chicken rice I don't know, I'll probably take it down to the homeless shelter or maybe just go to a homeless camp and say, here, here's some food if you want it, you know. A couple years or so, <laughs> get another bucket. Let's had it for 10. It's good to always have, because you know, you just don't know. And if I get over to the East Coast, I, I know there's bad weather and, and I may need it definitely over there. At least, you know, a month. Who knows what happened? I get snowed in or storm hits or whatever, you know.